This is actually the first video I'm gonna see from Easy and Natalie where they sit down and talk to us. You ladies have a lot of explaining to do. We're gonna get straight to it because this is an 18-minute video. Easy and Natalie posted a video called How We Feel After the Breakup. Is it over? Y'all, we already know y'all didn't break up from the last video, remember? Y'all were laughing and joking about it at the end. So why even title this video like that? I'm like, oh lord. Anyways, let's just jump right in. Are y'all ready to react? Cause I am. Let's get it. Are y'all going to get back together after this breakup? So are we gonna get back together? You literally was walking out with another girl holding her hand and what, didn't expect me to punch her in the face? <laughs> How that crown look, DC gang? <laughs> <laughs> Not the crown, right off your head. That's my crown. It ain't your crown, Shotty. It ain't your crown. Obviously, it's my crown, Easy Gang. You already see what happened, and if you didn't, I'm not even gonna say too much. Go to our last video, check it out, you know. It's like this. You both deserve the crown for fucking with your fans' heads. Mostly the young kids. Y'all are their role models, and y'all are fucking with them. Keep that in mind. Here right now to discuss our future. Pretty much, okay? <laughs> so, anyways. <laughs> so, I text my baddies and Measy gang members. Uh -huh. And I asked them, did they have any specific questions they wanted us to answer after all of this confusion for the last week? And you guys text me back. So if you don't have my number, make sure you shoot me a text so that we can go back and forth. But here are some of the questions. She's salty. Can y'all tell by her energy how salty she is, Nisi Gay? Y'all can feel it. Here's I know y'all, bro. Y'all know she's salty, bro. Here's, she's salty. Here's the thing. What's the thing? All right. She thinks that makes her the prank queen because I dropped the ball. But I, if I recall correctly, what? the reason my phone number is even out there is because she dropped the ball in a prank. Does so, it matter? It happens. <laughs> to the best of us. So make sure you guys give this a thick, 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 thick thumbs up, okay? So basically, from where the video is going right now, you're still not gonna let your fans know that this whole thing is a skit. That's okay, if that's your way of entertaining. I'm okay with that because guess what? Your entertainment is entertaining me to where I'm entertaining my viewers. So y'all keep lying to your fans, I'm okay with that. Comment below with your thumbs up, just okay. like me. <laughs> Comment below what you guys want to see and make sure you screen record your favorite part of this video, even the last video. We didn't even tell you guys to do it in that video. I don't think we did, did we? Did you? I don't remember. Okay, so screen record your favorite part of this video or the last video so we can post you on our Instagram, okay? Let's get to the questions. Let's get to the juice. Go ahead. Let's get, get to them it. questions. I want to so, know. So the first question is, first question, are y'all going to get back together after this breakup? Y'all got these people fooled. Oh, are we gonna get back together? Fooled. Boy, I don't know, cuz if I get bad order, that means she thinks she's gonna get the crown, boy. That's this it's official. You know, we broke up officially. Girl, you feel me? Never. <laughs> you could never. I could never what? You could never. I could never want me without me. Stop playing. She right. Measy gang. She right. She trying to stop playing. She right. She right. She right. I love this girl, bro. All right, what's the next question? What's the next All right, question? somebody wants to know, I guess this kind of goes perfectly with this. Okay. Did Wait. we really break up? Nah. Mm -hmm. Nah. We didn't Come really on, break up. I wanted Natalie to think that it was about to be over after this fight that I just got into, but we did not actually break up. And I literally wanted to. But I was like, I'm not gonna push it that far. Even though she went way too far you with the prank, bro. Yes, I did. Girl, I wish you would. I'm trying to stop coming away. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I want to say this. I love the fact that that Natalie has been a lot more affectionate on camera. Even that little piece. I'm gonna rewind it. Y'all know about my rewind game. That little piece right there. Cause I love human interaction. This is why I have a reaction channel. I like to see stuff like this. I'll try to stop going on. I know. It's cute, you know? <laughs> Imagine if I more open. find out though, what do you think would have really happened? I what do you think? Before I would have... I don't think you would have fought that quick. 
No, I definitely would have. You know, so I would have been able to tell you it was a prank. And yeah. then you just but you thought that the prank was real, and I was able to fight her. But that's what I'm saying. You wouldn't have really done that. You wouldn't have really yes. fought that quick. You're right. But I'm just saying from your perspective. You would. You watch. You. <laughs> your perspective. You thought thought I her. Yeah, but that wasn't the question. You Look what just happened right there. Even they're confused on what happened. They know that whole thing was a skit, but they had to play it off like it's a prank that they were both in on. And Easy's over here asking her a question of how would she really be if it was real. They're even confused. She can't even answer the damn question, a simple ass question, because it's confusing. They have to pretend to talk about a skit that was a prank, but was really a skit. You get what I'm saying? They're confused right now. <laughs> Girl, what would she do without me, y'all? Uh, all right, go ahead. Next question. So the next question is, why would y'all play with my heart like that in the last video? I cried real tears for y'all. See? Like, that hurt. Heartbreak, heartbreak. See? I'm so that's my point. You guys, that's my motherfucking point. What, is it really worth messing with these kids' brains? Because I know they're children's. There's no way that you're an adult and you believe all this. There's no fucking way. But you guys are over there breaking little kids' hearts. Okay? Sorry, Easy Gang. Like, <laughs> I had to do it. Y'all been testing me. It's literally saying I'm not the prank queen. And the fact that I literally had information with her trying to prank me, I had to do it. And, and, and I, just, I, couldn't, I couldn't stop it. I was just so into it. Listen, Easy Gang. What? What? Not to... And you see their smiles on their face. Listen, I like Easy and Natalie. I do. But their platform by the end of the day is a business. At this point, it doesn't even matter who's crying about their fake breakup, who's sad about their fake breakup, who's falling about their fake breakup. It don't matter. They're making money. They have become successful. I, I just hope one day they let everyone know that these were all skits. What? I would never break your heart like that. She pranked you, not me. So just remember that I love you. You're my babies, okay? What? <laughs> like I said before, if the video, like if I didn't know, you would have definitely gotten broken up with You definitely would have. <laughs> that you would have broke their heart. heart. You would have broke their heart. You would have broke their heart, period. 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 Just remember that when you say who the prank queen Okay, so the next question is for Natalie. How did you really feel when the fight broke out? And why would you do that to cause a break? Let's start oh, here. Easy game. Okay, I'm gonna start with the first part of the question. My heart <laughs> dropped to my stomach. Bro, you were still recording for a little bit. And I was like, you were yeah, I was still recording because I'm like, this is prime time TV. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, okay, okay. You saw your girlfriend getting into a fight? That's what you're thinking about? Nah, you're protective, girl. You would never allow that shit. You would try to break that fight apart. No, but if it was real. See, I was just like in shock. I was totally in shock. I was just like, what is going on? And the crazy thing is, Brianna and I kept talking about like, oh, what, is she gonna fight me? I was like, nah, she's not gonna fight me. I ain't like that. That was just running right right through my head the whole time. Like, I just told this girl that she wasn't gonna fight her. I felt bad for Brianna, cause I'm like, dang. You see, now you're contradicting yourself. That makes no sense. You said you felt bad for Brianna, but yet you're filming it. But you feel bad. Y'all y'all are fucking up in this video, yo, a lot. If you want your true supporters to still believe you, you should have reviewed this video before you posted it. Just saying. Uh, I got her into this, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was shook. You were shook? And the second question, answer the second question says, and why? Would you do that to cause a breakup? First of all, y'all know what type of channel this is, okay? Like, not only is it about our relationship, but it's also Pranks. about the fun that we have pranking each other. Skits. So we signed up for we it. We signed, signed up for it. So yeah. I didn't do it to cause a breakup, and yeah. she didn't really break up with me, so. Okay. Next question. Where do you guys see yourselves in five to ten years as far as marriage, kids, career? <laughs> First of all, let me say this. Calm down. Obviously. Calm down. Obviously. What? We still gonna have to be together because y'all just be losing your <laughs> shit. <laughs> and I gotta break up. So we can't break up. We, we don't have no choice. We, we gotta make this work. We gotta make it work. Can I say something? 
without y'all getting mad, they're not gonna last. And I'm saying this right now. So when they break up, I'm gonna edit this part into a video reacting to their breakup, their real breakup. And the reason why I say this is because they're literally living their relationship in front of the camera. It's all about skits, it's all about pranks, it's all about jokes, it's all about vlogs. That's gonna cause problems. They're literally working together all the time for this channel. You're gonna lose yourselves individually, you're gonna lose yourselves as a couple. Y'all already know a lot of YouTube couples don't last and it's, and it's because of this. That's just what I think. Not for just y'all, but for us, you know? So, yeah. <laughs> or do you see? I have a question. What um, do you see as an honest honestly, For real, for real, yeah. I don't just be probably. Look, we don't got that much time. Time <laughs> oh, oh, what's, the old, what's the oldest you have kids? I'm like, <laughs> you know, we're going to have to start. In the next five or ten years, hopefully we're still together. What? Oh, and you she has out. broken up with me over a prank. <laughs> don't you? I'm going to spit all over the camera. It's okay. Sorry, easy. Yeah, you have it anyway, don't you put that out there? Yeah, universe. don't break up with me over no dang prank. Fest. Well, don't put that out there like that. I love you. That would never happen, ever. I love you too. Never say never. So, um, next five to ten years, definitely, you know, we would have to like start having those type of conversations, like yes. marriage, kids, kids career, career, career. Where do you see yourself at? Is that the thittering? think that you know we're gonna be even more popular than we are now we're gonna be in you know we're gonna be a-list actors for sure mark my word a-list actors they are fooling the world with their acting skills so we'll have our own network we're gonna have our own network okay we'll have our Oprah. Own shows and stuff yeah, like okay, that okay Oprah. So all, all that y'all know this again and i'm not gonna lie to you i freaking love kids bro like yeah. i've wanted kids since a kid you know, at 18, you kid. right, since 18, I'm like, I want a kid, I want a kid, I want a kid. Now that I've found the love of my life, I'm like, cool, oh, let's have a kid. Of course, she's not ready, which I respect. But As you now should. that I got a doggy, a little pup pup, I'm like, girl. You can wait. We can wait. <laughs> you can wait. We can wait. <laughs> little Pluto, baby Pluto, that's my baby. Y'all know I love my baby. It's a blessing because of that. But yeah, I don't, I just, I mean, look. We can wait. <laughs> it's a lot of work. It's, it's a lot of work. Okay, so the next question is, question mark, question mark, question mark. When you guys saw the outpouring of concern and love for you guys from those of us, who's texting you while I'm reading this? Get it done, you. Okay. <laughs> when you guys saw the outpouring of concern and love for you guys from those of us who were praying that you didn't actually break up, how did you feel? Okay, PC gang, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna answer this. I felt terrible. And I was just like, yo, what? Like, I, I didn't want to drag it on. When you say I feel terrible, with a big old cheesy smile on her face. I had to, y'all kept playing me, especially when we went live on our Instagram, and I was like, I'm the prank queen, and everybody said, no, no, he is. I'm like, yo, we gotta take this above and beyond, okay? I'm the freaking prank queen, but I definitely feel bad. I'm so sorry, Nisi Gang. I didn't even mean to drag it out. It it happened, it just happened. I'm I just sorry. wanna say that was the longest, like, few days of my life. I felt horrible. I kept saying to Nisi, like, they're freaking out. You guys were hitting up yeah. all of our friends and family members. My mom, my like, brother. I was like, we need to tell them. And then he was like, I know. I felt bad. Oh, it was crazy. It was, but it also did make us like feel even more love for you guys. Yeah. Because it just showed how much you guys really so care about us. us. Y'all love us. I love how much you guys love us. It's so freaking incredible. But to answer you guys' questions, we felt horrible. Next question. Okay, so the next question is why didn't you log out? If you guys don't know what she's talking about, they're literally asking, apparently you didn't even know what they're talking Wait, about. Wait, what is that one? They're asking why didn't I log out of Easy's Instagram. So, oh. You guys have to go watch 
the last video if you don't know what they're talking about. Yeah. And the reason why I didn't is because I forgot. I simply forgot. I logged into her Instagram because I was just simply uploading something and I didn't have service. And oh, then, you okay. know, we're close like that, so okay. I, didn't, I didn't think anything of like leaving is myself logged in. So I didn't remember so when I was yeah, Is that what happened? That okay. I was still logged in on her phone, so mm. she was getting the messages. Okay, gotcha. so the next question is, how did you guys get that video from across the street? Again, if you don't know what they're talking about, you gotta watch the last video, one of our most epic videos out there, okay? But I didn't grab the video. Literally, somebody posted the video on Instagram, which was completely unexpected. Which is very easy to do. All you have to do is create an account on Instagram under a whole different alias and post that video. That's all. Yo, that was not us at all. They, I guess they caught us filming, you know what I'm saying? So they seen it and I'm like, yo, we're gonna use this to our advantage. And that also answered you guys' question how I felt. And the reason why I left you guys in the dark so long because of that video specifically, okay? It was literally that video because I'm like, yo, now I wasn't even gonna prank y'all. It was just about her and her only. But whoever posted that video, literally I was like, well, I have to, I have to leave it. I have to leave it like just, we gotta just leave it on pause for a little bit. So we didn't post like for like four days, y'all. And I just had to have the build up so I could really get that crown. Cause I'm the prank. You guys, come on now. Come on now. The next question is, that was cold blooded. I don't know which part they thought, either the part that I did or the no, part that she did. Definitely the part. I'm pretty sure it was the part that I did because they were texting it. But anyway, they want to know, are there any... And for those who are watching the easy, this Easy and Natalie video through their channel, have y'all noticed all those fucking ads that are playing on this video? You won't see it on mine because I skipped through it. Watch their video and you see that they add the fuck out of it. They're trying to make that money. I don't blame them. They're hustlers. That are off limits. Not really, to be honest. There's not really anything off limits, unless there's anything that causes physical harm. Yeah. But which is what we signed up for, literally, it's like we had a waiver. We had to sign our own waiver. Like, look, no matter what we do, if you're signing up for this YouTube and to entertain people, if you get pranked, you get pranked, okay? Okay, so the next question is, we have to take a little break. I know y'all can't tell, but we took a little break. <laughs> All right, so the next question is, in your opinion, did the Neezy Gang supporters respond the same or did they respond better than the last time you guys broke up? Ah, I don't know because, okay, so this is what I think. My opinion, I think they responded worse only because we left them in the dark. So a lot of them was blowing up so many of my family members, even family members I didn't even think y'all knew. But I think they kind of responded worse. Like, but what do you think? I don't think so. I think Neezy Gang... They only had you guys wait for one day. That little clip was posted on Thursday. They usually post a video on Friday, which they chose to hold off on. The only day that they kept you in the dark because they do not post videos on the weekends. And as usual, on schedule, they posted their video on Monday. They only had y'all wait for one day. This ain't nothing new. How much you guys really so care about us. us. Y'all love us. I love how much you guys love us. It's so freaking incredible. But, to you guys' question. I will say this. Their fans are fucking loyal. They are dedicated. They are committed to them. And I only know this because I got them coming over to my channel talking their shit. And it's okay though. Come to my channel. Come watch me. Everyone is welcome. I don't discriminate. Like, but what do you think? I don't think so. I think Music Gang responded better this time. And all, the only reason mm -hmm. I say that is because last time I feel like there was, it was <laughs> overwhelming how much like hate oh, yeah, it was. Like, hate it was towards Natalie. People just it was saying bad. the meanest things, attacking me. I couldn't even yeah. post a, a post without all the comments being about me and Easy. Mm -hmm. So this time it was definitely, I didn't, I only had like a couple comments under my last post about it. And yeah. I, I had a lot, I had a lot, but I don't really, I didn't really more people like concerned and just saying we love you like we're gonna support you regardless i have yeah. those type of messages more so than like the hate ones so. okay yeah also too though you're right to like piggyback off that like this i feel like some music gang like supporters did feel that this could have been a prank oh what was that for i don't know okay
That was cute. <laughs> I have to watch that again. Uh, I have to watch that again. Let's watch that again, please. Something about piggyback is what touched her. <laughs> I lied. Easy when she said when she said to piggyback off that. Natalie's face went to like a loving state. Something about that she found attractive. <laughs> I align, look. This type of message is more so than like the hate one. Okay. Yeah, also too though, you're right to like piggyback off that. Like this, I feel like some easy gang like supporters. She's admiring her right now. She's admiring her right now. She's like, oh, I love you. Did feel that this could have been a prank. What was that for? Ah, there they Okay. <laughs> That's cute. I don't even know what I was saying. Distractions. Oh, okay. Distractions so, will do it. I think a lot of the easy game people, some, some of them probably suspected that this was a prank. You know what I'm saying? Versus the other one, was, which was an actual breakup, our first and last time ever breaking up. We weren't really officially together though, but it was like, it was a possibility we weren't gonna be together. But, I don't know what I was saying. I'm so distracted by your love. Y'all get the, y'all get the message. <laughs> All right, this question is, so what are you going to do to rectify the situation with Easy? What are you gonna do to make it up to me? You know, you literally was walking out with another girl <laughs> holding her head and what, didn't expect me to punch her in the face? I don't know, I'm gonna have to figure something out. Exactly, I'm gonna have to figure something out. <laughs> rectify it, Natalie, cause my heart was broken. My heart was broken into pieces. <laughs> I got this ice box where my heart used to be. Cold, so cold, so cold, so cold. careful when you guys joke around with stuff like that because domestic violence ain't no fucking joke i know y'all are playing but y'all don't want your supporters who are mostly children to think that's okay so be careful because this was not the only time y'all done this so be careful make sure you guys like and subscribe we love you guys so much thank you guys for supporting us text both of us here's natalie's number here's okay. my number we love and thank you guys so much for supporting us uh anything you want to say to these game Love you. Bye. Love you Bye. Please subscribe. Bye. Alright, music game. Oh shit. Now what? So easy has no idea. But that last question was literally perfect asking me, what am I gonna do to rectify the situation between Easy and I? So she has no idea, but um I have a beautiful date surprise for her. And I've never actually asked Easy on a date before. I've never okay. like, even done anything like this for anybody I've dated before because I mean I'm used to being wine and dine so yeah it's kind of different when you're in a lesbian relationship girl welcome to the community tonight <laughs> I'm gonna be doing that for her and I also have a gift for her that she has wanted for a long time so this is gonna be very special mm. um it's probably gonna be like our next video but um yeah so make sure y'all stay tuned for it and I'm so excited <laughs> Okay, I'll watch that. I'll watch that dating video. It's, it's most likely a vlog. So I'm getting tired of these fake pranks. I ain't lying. When you guys saw the outpouring of <laughs> when you guys saw the out when you guys saw the outpouring of concern and love for you guys. Okay, I got it. No, I got it. I got it. She might be illiterate. Really, to be honest, there's not really anything off limits other than if it's gonna be something to cause physical. Unless if there's something that causes like physical harm. Oh, someone just got there. <laughs> Who that was? Who that was? 
All right, you guys, that was today's video. Please don't send too much hate on my channel, okay? Well, you're more than welcome to. Viewer engagement is always welcome. All right, you guys, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.